Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. As you already know, I have been given this awesome, gorgeous planner by the Paper House Productions, and I have decided that I am going to make this planner my One Book July planner. I know. I am going to try to stay on this planner for the entire month of July without having to go to my bujo or any other planners. I've never done one book July ever, so wish me luck. I had already prepped my bujo to for the month of July because I told myself, you know, I never finished my bujo last year because I switched from my bujo to another planner and I was about to do the same for my bujo this year and I had already set it up and I know that I made a video. I'm not sure if this video is going to go up before or after that video but if this one goes after I post that video, know that I am going to stay on this planner for the month of July even though I set up my bujo for the month of July as well. As you already know, this is an undated planner. I already did a flip through with this planner. If you didn't see that video, I am going to link it down below. But I am going to set it up so that I could start using it for the month of July. Okay, so I am going to use, let's see. So you know, I do use different planners for my billings, different planners for my social media, the home planner, my own planner, the work stuff. I have different planners for different things, but I'm going to try to stay on this planner and we'll see how that goes. Well, I have some of the events that I have going on for the month of July and let me start setting it up. Let's do it. Okay, I love that I have blank pages. So what I'm going to do, I'm just gonna add a lot of colors. Let me just date here first, and then I'm gonna add a whole bunch of colors. And a lot of the stuff that I already have from the paper house. You know what guys, I, I started, but I, I remember I have this nice Happy Planners Memories Keeping, and it has like all these numbers on there and I think I'm going to use these I'm going to use this to label all these little boxes here I'm gonna do that really quick and I'll be right back let me just decorate first because I have I'm dying to use these little boxes here and I'm dying to use this Japanese rice paper washi tape that they have here and you know as a matter of fact I'm gonna put this right on top and what I'm gonna do I'm gonna try to use all these stickers throughout my setup for the month of July and just oh my god this is so cute oh how cute actually you know what we're going away the week of the 17th I'm gonna use some for this week right here This is really nice. This is like paper. Look, here's a closer look. They're real pretty. I've never seen this before. These are really different from what I'm used to seeing. And I am loving them. God, they look so pretty already, right? Okay, so now I have all of these to decorate, and I saw some boxes. Where is that? This box, I'm dying to use this right here. This one says, Say hello to summer, it's super fun. So maybe I should put it right here. Yeah, I like it. It's super cute. See what else we got. 
Now, I know that I have four birthdays. And they sent me like the prettiest. How cute are these? Look at them. These are very pastel colors and these are more colorful. Okay, and since there's four of them, I'm gonna put four cupcakes right over here. Okay, I have a few things that I need to accomplish this month and I am going to give myself a checklist because I I'm a visual person so I need this to stare at me the entire month so that I keep on track and these are perfect and super pretty and they match I love this it's so colorful I love this I've been dying to use this sticker right here it says summer loving and I'm gonna place it somewhere in here to put it here yes yeah right over here and where my flamingos oh my god how pretty i don't mind that this is overlapping because it's i'm gonna be on vacation on that week anyway so i don't mind Okay, so I have a few things. Well, actually, let's put some flowers in this corner right here to give it that finished look, kind of, yeah. I love that these are repositionable. Okay, let's see. Let's see what I have going on here. So, okay, going back to this pretty book here, I think I am going to use these dots for the things that I have going on in the month. One because this I think these are too big and they're just like huge. <laughs> and I feel that if you, if I put anything else it's just going to be too 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 much. So I am going to place these dots in these little corners here. To identify the things that are happening on a particular day or if there are bills and I'll put the green one for the bills because um, these are huge I have a doctor's appointment so I'm going to use oh my god I love these how pretty these are. These are vibrant and these are more pastel colors. <laughs> now you know what? Now that I'm putting this down, I need to call and cancel because we're gonna be away. So that's not happening. I need to call and reschedule, so that's what I'm gonna do. Okay guys, I feel that these numbers are so big that if I add anything else, it's just going to be too much. So I'm going to leave it as is. I'm going to write my plans for the month and I think I want to leave it just as is. Okay guys, I am going to leave it just as is right now. I will put my goals, these are a little personal, that's why I'm not writing them down right now. So I am leaving this as is. I am going to figure out how I want to set up my notes pages, but I, at this moment right now, I'm not sure how I'm going to do that. So whenever I am ready, I will post this in my Instagram account. Okay, so don't forget to give my video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!